After a tight race for state representative in Wyndham's general election, a hand recount was conducted by the Secretary of State's office. I was short by 24 votes, which was a tough loss. I've run a number of times. The recount found approximately 300 additional votes for each of the winning candidates, while the candidate requesting the recount, Democrat Christy St. Laurent, lost 99 votes. Because the discrepancy was so great, it's around a 6% discrepancy, um, in, in vote totals, they had asked the attorney general's office to investigate. According to the town, attorneys have requested information about the ballot machines and how they handle elections. In a letter to the town, the AG's office says they will work with local election officials to implement or refine their protocols and procedures. In the meantime, St. Laurent is now pushing to have the ballots looked at again. However, the AG's office says the law prohibits more than one recount. I think we should be able to count them. Now they're just evidence. They're a paper trail for us to go back and figure out where the mistake happened and just make sure it doesn't happen again. There will be a selectman's meeting on February 22nd and the voting machine company will be there. They have indicated that they are willing to do, you know, whatever because they want to have their name cleared. Wyndham's town clerk says the town takes this alleged discrepancy extremely seriously and we are cooperating to the full extent. Our main priority is to get to the bottom of this important matter. It's inexplicable, but we do need an answer if we're going to be confident in our elections going forward. Kristin Carosa, WMUR News 9.